A group of students were solving math problems in their class. Their teacher, Miss Perkins, was very strict. She would get angry if you didn't know the answer. But one day she had an idea. She wanted to see who was paying attention, so she asked them this question: If you have ten apples and you lose four, how many do you have left? All the students got their answer right except for one. The student got it wrong. Miss Perkins was very angry. Do you know what the answer is? Do you even know how to count? The student started crying. I'm sorry, I don't know. Then Miss Perkins gave him an opportunity to make things right. She said, "Since you don't know the answer, I want you to go to the store and bring me some apples. You can go with Tom. Tom was the smartest kid in the class. He knew all the answers. So Miss Perkins sent him with the boy to the store." On the way to the store, the boy said to Tom, "Please help me. I don't want to be in trouble again." Tom replied, "Okay, but only if you share your cookies with me. You always have the best snacks." The boy agreed. They went to the store and bought ten apples. Then they returned to the classroom. Miss Perkins was so happy to see that they brought apples. She washed them and she divided them into two piles, ten apples. She gave four apples to Tom and six apples to the other boy. Now you have six apples and Tom has four apples. Can you figure out which one of us has more? The boy asked. Tom thought for a moment. You have more apples than me. But you also had more apples than me when we left the classroom. The boy was confused. What do you mean? Tom explained. When we came back from the store, we each got ten apples, and then we put the apples together, meaning we had twenty apples. Then you took four of your apples and put them in my pile. So you still have sixteen apples, while I only have twelve. The boy couldn't believe it. So does this mean you actually have less apples than me? Yep, I have four less apples than you," said Tom. "Wow, that's amazing!" "Thank you," said the boy. "You're welcome," said Tom. Then they went to Miss Perkins and told her about the number of apples they had. She was so happy that they had figured out how to solve the problem. Instead of getting in trouble, the boy received a good grade for figuring out the problem with Tom. And from that day on, he stopped crying in class because he knew that his friend Tom would always help him. Hey, did you know that you can help us with something? Well, you can leave a like and a comment down below on this video. We really appreciate when you take the time to do that. Thanks for watching and see you next time.